I, th I think you've got us off to an excellent start. You know, I think your emphasis on its people and their development is hugely important, and using the IT better to manage the knowledge um, and to that link between the international conventions and what happens at national level, I think, is particularly important. So I now hand the, the floor over to, to, to Juma, who is going to speak from the perspective of Dubai Customs. Um, when I first read the document, Customs in the 21st Century, I said, wow, what a great vision. However, I'd like to see that vision in my lifetime. I don't have to wait 88 years until I see that happening. I don't think anybody in this room will live that long. However, the main striking points I find in that document is intelligence and connectivity, in addition to the other pillars. Connectivity with data and information has been discussed earlier in terms of utilizing the data for intelligence. But that is probably here already. The te technology already exists. It's all a matter of us using it for predictive modeling and analysis that we spoke about earlier, as well as the connectivity between customs and customs, uh, government and customs, business and customs. What we really lack is knowing what is the roadmap to reach there. The document, it's a great vision, but there is no end to it. We'd like to see something perhaps that is more concrete, a proper uh, dates for the completion in terms of short term, mid term, and long term. And when I say long term, I mean 10 years. And that is what we should be striving at and then go for the next challenge because technology is moving too fast and we are not moving as fast as technology. And that's my argument. Thank you very much.